I turned my room into a living ecosystem gallery. My oldest terrarium is 1,000 days old and houses some poison dart frogs. These guys are near threatened due to habitat loss in their natural environment, and I'm happy to say that they're reproducing. In the tank next door, I have a trio of Tinctorius Azarus poison dart frogs. These guys are a lot more common and a lot more bold. One of my newer creations is this polydarium. The main star here is this betta fish and also a colony of sherry shrimp. I also have this moss wall terrarium that's mostly just for show. There's really no animals living on the land section except for a small cleanup crew of orange and tropical springtails, the same that live in all of my terrariums. This is going to be a future poison dart frog terrarium. I just added plants and the wet moss mix a few days ago as well as the cleanup up crew consisting of some tropical springtails. Lastly, I have this vampire crab terrarium that's over one year old. It also has cherry shrimp and a whole bunch of vampire crabs, as the name would suggest. Would you ever consider building a bioactive terrarium? And let me know which one of mine, if any, was your favorite.